Okay, so today I want to talk to you about living off grid and uh, having electricity, all the electricity you want. So uh, a lot of my neighbors out here, we're all off grid and, and uh, some of them, you know, they wanted power from the power company and the power company in some cases want twenty, twenty-five thousand dollars to connect. My one neighbor <clears throat> already had power poles crossing his property that was going to an oil well, and they wanted uh, $18,000 for him to connect, and uh, the power was already on his property. So, uh, you know, they want you to get hooked into that perpetual debt, which uh, they'll send you a bill even after you're dead. So you can never pay it off. It's a, it's a perpetual debt that you owe even after you're dead. That's what happens when you connect to the utility. Now, a lot of people come to me and they say, well, the power company wants $30,000 just to connect. So what can I get for $30,000? And I say, well, for $30,000, you can get more power than you'll use in your lifetime and it'll be paid for and you'll own it and you'll never have a bill to anyone ever. And they're like, wow. So uh, the question then might be, why isn't everybody on solar? Well, because they're stupid. But the main reason is because you have to pay it all at once. The power company finances you. They can, you can pay them one, two, three hundred dollars a month for all oh, 80 years and then they'll let you have power. So uh, that's quite a bit of money, you know, two or three hundred dollars a month for 80 years. You know, you can calculate that out, and and uh, if you had that money to retire on, <laughs> you'd be living pretty good. So uh, it's pretty well you have to be stupid to connect to the utility. Now in town it's convenient, and that, but of course in town you buy a square inch of land for a hundred thousand dollars, and out here you can get a mile, square mile, for that kind of money. So. Uh, land out here if you look around and you know uh, do your due, due, due diligence you can probably find land for one or two thousand dollars an acre right over there is a nice view of the lake you can't see it but uh, anyhow so solar panels there's I got this one little rack right here and uh, then I got some solar panels up on that roof, and I got another one over there on that roof, just a single over there. And uh, so I have all the power I want. I can run air compressors, I can run refrigerators, uh, I can run whatever I want to run. And in fact, during the day when the sun's shining, I got far more electricity than I'll ever use, ever. Now at night, I store my electricity in batteries, which. Uh, last all night and of course in the morning the sun comes out. This particular area is good for wind and so wind generally blows when the sun isn't shining so that complements solar really well. But uh, I'm going to be making more of these videos and you can uh, go to the link at the bottom of this video and get more information. Uh, there's federal incentives. Uh, right now the federal incentive is 30 percent, so if you spend 10 grand, you can take uh, $3,333.33 right off the top of your taxes. Of course, there's state and local incentives also, so, uh, you know, you can, and so that makes it even better. And uh, so one thing about solar is you can start really low, you can start uh, with a thousand dollar system and have electricity and then uh, maybe all you can run is your computer or a television or something, charge your phones, but you'll have electricity. And you can add batteries to last longer at night, and you can add more solar panels to get you, and you can add those things anytime you want. It's completely modular. So, you know, you can build it into a super system to where you've got so much power, you can even sell power to your neighbors. So, uh, that's, you know, basically, what I want to help you people do is, is uh, uh, become self-sufficient and uh, uh, get out from under that satanic uh, grid. Uh, and that's what it is. It's perpetual debt. There's, there's nothing good about it. 
uh, you know, it's 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 just you know the shit's gonna hit the fan one of these days, and and uh, the power's gonna go out in a lot of places as it does all the time already, because the power they don't give a shit if the power goes off. What do they care about you? You know, you're good for millions of dollars. They're gonna suck you dry till you die, a little after you die too. So they don't care if you have power or not. You know, they've got hundred thousand dollar trucks that sit around and haven't even been used for six months. So. Uh, you can own it, and the power goes off when you turn it off, and uh, you don't have a bill, you don't have to pay anybody anything. Uh, solar panels don't wear out, there's no moving parts, so in 650 years your grandchildren's grandchildren's grandchildren can still be using the damn solar panels. <laughs> so, of course there will be something better by then, but thing is, you don't have to pay that perpetual debt. If you just get your pencil out and you look at what $200 a month is for 80 years, it's quite a sum. So uh, uh, if you like this video, then uh, click on like and uh, you can follow me if you want. I'm going to uh, be doing more and uh, we'll see you next time. Kill it. Okay.